Hi, my name is Matt Albright. I'm product manager at the Lincoln Electric Company. Today I'd like to talk to you about the newest addition to the FlexTech family, the FlexTech 650. When we set out to design this family, we had three goals in mind. The first goal was to design a machine that had the durability and the reliability of traditional SCR transformer based machines. The second goal was to design a machine that incorporated the art characteristics that people come to enjoy from an inverter style machine. The third goal was to make a machine that met the budget of those customers who were looking for the durability and the reliability of that type of machine. Today, as we look at this user interface of this machine, we have the standard mode selection or process selection from gas tungsten arc welding all the way down to CV sub arc welding. So the operator will start here, select the process that he's going to be using, for instance CV, and then step through the rest of this functionality. We have a simple main control on the front of this user interface to allow the operator to very simply adjust his main operating settings. This is our hot start feature. This optional feature allows you to add more energy at the initiation of the arc for those situations that may require it. We have the local and remote settings, depending on whether or not our customers are using a foot pedal or a hand amstrol, this will set the machine accordingly. And then arc control. Arc control will be used for those customers who want more arc force or less arc force from a stick welding application, or they want more or less inductance while CV welding. These, this control is more of a fine tune once the process is set up to really get them into that sweet spot for the specific uh, application they're using. Weld terminals on and off allows the operator to have either the complete OCV to the terminals so that for stick welding they're ready to go or if they want to turn them off and run a, a different wire feeder through another method as well as when they're running on they can use across the arc feeders. The FlexTech 650 can accommodate all of Lincoln Electric's wire feeder family. We can do across the arc feeders by hooking up to the terminals and turning them on. We can do the 115 voltage fed feeders and 42 volt feeders as well. Additional features that we see here is the ability to select that voltage. So operators who set the different feeders up can pick which feeder they're running to simplify the setup. We have the, the feeder hookup, the remote amphenol hookup, whether it's a foot pedal or hand amphenol. And we also have the polarity selection for the feeder. Depending on what process the operator is running, whether it's DC negative or DC positive, they can select that to get the proper setting on those feeders who require that. We've added a different configuration to the front of the machine. On the FlexTech 450 we had a complete control panel coverage. The additional features that we added to the 650 required us to modify that front a little bit and we added these simple boots to allow the operators to get in and out to quickly remove and add welding terminals as needed for their application. The FlexTech 650 is a 10 to 815 amp output machine, so this can accommodate the full range of processes a customer could expect to experience. This machine can also be paralleled with an additional FlexTech 650 and used for gouging applications that require extreme high amperages. The FlexTech 650 also comes equipped with the standard 115 15 amp auxiliary. The 115 is great for customers who are running grinders in the same area or they have radios or coolers that they have on their job site this machine can handle those types of ratings. A new feature of the FlexTech 650 is the fact that there's more control on the user interface. With the FlexTech 650 you get a complete range to allow the operator to customize setups for his specific application. The FlexTech 650 weighs 165 pounds which means that this machine is significantly lighter than any of its counterparts the DC 600 or the CV 655. Although the FlexTech 650 is a very light machine compared to its predecessor it does come standard with a forklift cut out in the center to help maneuver this machine on job sites if necessary. We can fit four of these machines into a rack which allows for more mobility and flexibility on the job site, something that would become very difficult with a larger transformer rectifier type machine. We do a very good job of trying to destroy these machines during the testing phase and development of the machine and this product has gone through the full range of Lincoln testing from drop testing to verify that the lifting structure is secure from environmental temperature testing. This machine is desert duty rated which means it can operate at extreme temperatures which customers may encounter on shipyard type applications where this machine is sitting on metal decking or in a hot humid environment. This machine is going to be as durable and reliable as its predecessors the DC 600 and CV 655. Part of the testing that this machine goes through is an IP23 rating. What does that mean to the customer? That means that this machine can handle being operated in outside 
environments that get wet and they're dirty and encounter moisture in those areas. This machine is fully capable of handling those types of ratings and running environments and it can exceed customer expectations in those atmospheres. This machine also, since it's an inverter based machine, provides the customer with energy savings that they wouldn't see with a traditional SCR type machine. Just by plugging this machine and running it in a similar way that you were running a DC600 or SCR type machine, you could expect to pay off this machine off just by the energy savings alone. So when you add up reliability, durability, energy savings, and the improved art characteristics that operators are looking for, this machine is ready for any application, indoor or outdoor. If you need more information about either of these power sources, please log on to lincolnelectric.com.